Horse, two on one going the other way. Coletta trying to drive to the net. Pass comes across, it goes off Neal. Gibb has it, and then we see the Peets come in, trying to dig that puck free under Gibb. Well, the Peets are digging at Ryan Gibb, and that's not going to be allowed. Gee, is that Coletta in the middle of that, I wonder? Coletta wasn't originally involved, but it didn't take long for him and John Neal to... Yeah. Sorry, Adam Birdie to become partners, but... See Nasby trying to get the puck away, and the pass comes across and goes off Neal. See Daniel Ryder thinking it's still loose, jabbing at it, which you're taught to do. Jab it until you hear the whistle. And See the penalty calls are against. Looks like Neal and Ryder, I believe, or, the, or Birdie. Oh, the general's got two in the box. So the Peets will have a four on three power play here with a minute 27 to go in the first, I believe. Five on four. Great comeback period for the Generals, though, down shots eight to one and looking to get out played. And Ryan Gibb held him in there. You know, the team's so fragile right now, the confidence level, rightfully so, with the losing streak going on and not much success over the last three or four months. But trying to feel good about yourself when that guy's kicking out pucks and you want to play for a guy like that when he's battling as hard as uh, Ryan Gibb has so far in the first 20. See what penalties the referee hands out as he's talking to Randy Latticeur on the far side. And of course, I'm sure Randy doesn't agree with the calls. Well, Randy Latticeur is making sure they don't get a 10-minute misconduct here. He can't afford to lose Adam Birdie for 10 minutes. And uh, the de not a depleted lineup, but maybe a, a lineup that's tough to match for four lines as far as Oshawa and Peterborough. Look at Brandon McBride in behind there. The training staff of the Oshawa Generals. Usually the Oshawa-Peterborough games take about two and a half, three hours to play. And dragged out affairs. Yeah, they do. Of course, two franchises, I believe, that have had the most players play for them and go on the National League. I would, I would think you're absolutely right about that. The There's been a lot years. of players. As Clutterbuck now goes off. I think Peterborough is number one, and I think Oshawa is number two. I'm not sure what's going on here. Neither is the referee. Generals will. Well, there's only one penalty posted, 